Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, your ultimate destination for all things automobile diagnostic tools and programmers. If you're passionate about understanding the inner workings of your vehicle and keeping it in top-notch condition, you're in the right place. From in-depth reviews to step-by-step -step tutorials, we've got it all covered. So, before we dive into today's video, make sure to hit that subscribe button and click the bell icon so you never miss an update. Let's get started. The CGFC 200 BMW MSV 90 DME DTC off function enables you to disable diagnostic trouble codes, DTCs, without the need for third-party tools. Here's a detailed guide on using the FC200 ECU programmer for a BMW MSV 90 DTC OFF procedure, exemplified with a 2011 BMW 730 One. Model and ECU information. Car model, 2011 BMW 730 Lee. ECU slash DME, Continental MSV 90. Two, initial setup. Launch the CGFC 200 software. Check the DDC off car list to ensure the ECU is supported. The MSV 90 is included in this list. Three, ECU selection and preparation. Select BMW Continental MSV 90 TC 1796 and choose Platform Mode, Bench Mode. Review the wiring diagram provided by the software. Confirm that the pin configuration on the module matches the diagram. You will need to connect five wires, two red 12V, one GMD ground, and can H and can L. Four, wiring and connection. Follow the wiring diagram to connect the FC200 programmer to the MSV90 ECU. Ensure all connections are secure and accurate. 5. Data handling. Identify the ECU in the software. It is highly recommended to back up the ECU data before proceeding with the DDC off process. Read and save both the flash and flash data from the ECU. 6. Data modification. Once the data is backed up, send the flash data to a CGDI engineer Contact via QQ 800-163968. The engineer will modify the flash data to disable the DDCs and send the modified data back to you, free of charge. 7. Writing modified data. Write the modified flash data back to the MSV90 ECU using the CGFC200. The FC200 will automatically perform a checksum correction to ensure data integrity. 8. Reinstallation and verification. Reinstall the MSV90 DME back into the car. Use an OBD2 diagnostic scanner to verify that the DTCs have been successfully disabled. By following these steps, you can efficiently use the CGFC200 programmer to perform a DDC off on a BMW MSV90 ECU, enhancing your vehicle maintenance capabilities without relying on third-party tuners. Thanks for watching today's video. I hope you found it helpful and informative. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and leave a comment below letting me know your thoughts or any questions you might have. Your support means the world to me and helps keep this channel going. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and share this video with fellow automobile enthusiasts. Together, we can make the world of car diagnostics and programming a bit easier for everyone. Until next time, take care and happy diagnosing.